Hi, I'm Sebastian Blackwell. I'm the lead advocate of Bloom 365, a nonprofit organization dedicated to building healthy and safe relationships for all people. Our mission is to prevent teen dating abuse before it starts. Bloom 365 educates local youth about the importance of building healthy and safe relationships. We advocate on behalf of teen survivors and we activate students to be change agents in their communities. What would the world look like if unhealthy gender norms did not exist? Hey, my name is Joe Pineda and I'm an outreach advocate for Bloom 365. I work firsthand in helping teenagers build a healthier relationship and prevent teen dating abuse. At a local school here in the valley, I was talking to the teens and a student came up to me after and he said to me, he said, Sebastian, like, is it okay if I cry? And I was taken aback for a second and I was like, what do you mean? And he's like, well, I've never seen any men in my life cry. I've never um, seen my dad cry. And this stuff you're talking about makes it seem like it's okay if I cry. And I thought, well, of course. And I told him that. I said, of course, it's okay to cry. And we discussed further unhealthy gender norms. And uh, a student like this is a prime example. If there are people who are walking around in the world who think it's not okay to cry, it's very, very likely that those young men are a lot, or rather those young men are not likely to come forward to disclose that they've experienced any kind of victimization. One in seven men will experience domestic violence within their lifetime. We believe this is underreported because of the st stigma society has created. Bloom 365 is working to impact culture through our seven dose program where we talk about unhealthy gender norms and toxic masculinity. Changing culture starts with changing policies within our communities. Bloom 365 está aquí para crear un futuro mejor para los adolescentes. 